take any any person's money from OnlyFans. But you are taking their money. I'm not taking it. They're objectively you're taking their money. I'm not. Do you no, know what I'm objectively not. means or no? Like, I don't know how to explain it other than what it means. But yes. So what does it mean? It means what it means. That's not a good explanation. Yeah. So how big is it? I just have a quick question for you men out there. Do you feel like you're in less of a rush to get like married or settle down because of all the options there are nowadays with dating and you know today's dating culture? Because I just feel like the men have it so freaking easy. I see so many more men single in their 30s, 40s and they're just in the, they don't care they don't care they could just sleep around with all the little 20 year olds because most of them obviously like they're not ready to settle down they could have fun they could screw around but then it gets to the 30 year olds and we're on a freaking time we're on a time crunch but for the men they're not at all so they could be in their 40s and not giving a shit about if they settle down or not because you can still you know have a kid in your 40s 50s as a male more to the story and my question, men, do you think that you're taking dating less seriously in your 30s and 40s because of all the options there are out there in today's dating culture? I just want to know. Wait, they lie about their height and their yeah, occupation? All the yeah, time. all are the time. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I think everyone's been lying on dating apps, so I think it's okay for men to lie about their height. Response. By how much though? Like, what to what extent? Like, if you're Fuck five, it, dude. Ten, if you're, you're five six, just say you're six feet. Oh, absolutely not. That's way <laughs> Fuck too it, much. dude. <laughs> Bruv. Well, here, here's why. A lot of women on dating apps, the photos that they use on dating apps, full face of makeup, filters. That's lying. Ergo, we're just leveling the playing field. This boy be in my DM say I'm pretty. This boy be in my DM say I'm pretty. Just because you can put on panties and bra and you got 20 million likes, you know what I'm saying? You got 150 DMs per, per every one of them DMs, every one of them likes is trying to hit. They don't care what your name is. They don't care what you're going through. I don't care about none of the, none of that. When they take your ass out, all they see is naked ass. No matter what you got on, it can be negative thirty outside. They know you from your Instagram, <laughs> and all they see is naked ass. So it, it, quit with that, bro. Quit. It, it, it ain't no in between, bro. If you on your, if I go on your page, bro, and and eighty percent of your fucking pictures is you in brawn panties or something seductive, bro. What you what what you think, man? Thinking. $1,000 or you get to spend the day with me. Which are you choosing? I won't be offended. Thousand bucks. A thousand. <laughs> I can put a very bland, generic, average woman profile up on online dating and get 1,000 likes or messages or whatever they do in the online dating these days. Mm -hmm. And that woman will be like, well, hot damn, I'm, I'm a prize here. I got options versus the mm -hmm. most average bland dude won't get anything. No, that's never going to change. Women are the prize when it comes to the mating game, if you want to call it that. So women, I guess, innately know that, that, mm -hmm. oh, he doesn't like me. Well, guess what? I can open my front door and say, who wants this? And some dude's going to come running. And the ancillary to that is I look over to the man and go, who the hell are you to request any yeah. kind of demand? out of me i mean look at you dude i could drop you at any singles bar anywhere and you're going to come home alone i don't have to worry about a damn thing <laughs> so keep working with those two things and you got to get a picture for why those women are so quick to go well go after yourself why the fellas is mad at us i was talking to one of my homegirls not too long ago she tells me she's met the perfect guy right she's like he's great he's handsome great job all of that right standard wise preference wise he met everything. Later on, she tells me, and she's like, oh, I dubbed him. You know, he's just not right for me. And I'm like, well, what happened? Like, everything was good. Like, you were saying, like, 
this could have been future hubby like you was damn near on the right track for everything like he was just matching up you know what this woman tells me his car is old yo tell me with this i want you and i want us but then act like it i'm sick of words <laughs>